What's up guys, Zach from VR Forum here. Today I'm going to show you how you can easily take your Oculus Rift gameplay footage from this to this. Now if you've ever seen an Oculus Rift video or you record your own gameplay, that I'm sure you've noticed how all videos are recorded in a really warped side-by-side -side view and there's a lot of chromatic abrasion going on. So the reason for this is that when you actually see your game through the Oculus Rift, the lenses in the Rift de-warp the game or demo so that you see it in the normal stereoscopic 3D view that you see. So I'm going to show you a quick and easy way that you could de-warp your footage and remove the chromatic abrasion and basically just clean it up and make it look nice and presentable. So most of the hard work is already done for you. All you need to do is really download one tool and that's Unwarp VR. Now Unwarp VR is by every day and he is a youtuber and developer so i've included a link to unwarp vr in the description of the video go ahead and click that and you should come to this page now if you scroll down at the very bottom of this page you'll see two download links here one for unwarp vr for linux and one for windows now this tutorial is going to be focusing on the windows version so go ahead and click download on that so once you have that downloaded and you open it up you'll see ffmpeg unwarp vr.exe keep that window open as we're going to be needing it in a minute here so unwarp vr is actually a command line based program so if you were to double click on this exe and run it nothing's going to happen because in order to use it you need to actually type in commands into the command line so basically, if you are familiar with uh, the command prompt or the terminal, whatever you want to call it, at this point of the tutorial, you can just go ahead and look at the documentation here. There's all the commands listed here, um, and I'm sure you can figure it out for yourself. Now, if you're not familiar with the terminal, then I have created a simple GUI tool that you can download, and all you have to do is place it in the same folder as Unwarp VR and it will piggyback on top of it and send it the commands for you so you don't even have to mess around with any of that terminal crap. So go ahead and download Unwarp VR GUI. The link for it is also in the description of this video. And once you have both of those downloaded, all you have to do is place them in the same folder as each other. And you should see something like this, minus the footage. Now the footage is actually what we're going to be de-warping. I'll go ahead and show you this before Just some Minecraft video I took. Now, in order to get this de-warped, all we want to do is open the GUI tool. So that'll pop up. And what we're going to be doing is browsing to the footage I just showed you. And we're going to just open the footage up here. Now, once we have that open, you'll see a couple of options. Mono will basically spit out a mono version of the video. It'll render the left lens only. Um, but you're not going to get very good quality with this. It's only going to come out in 720 at the highest. So if you're already doing a 720p video, then this will be perfect for you. So you could also choose to render a test frame just to see what it's going to look like. But basically for the most part, you're just going to want to leave it at the default settings. Pick the resolution that you want and click Unwarp. Now you're going to see this terminal window pop up and it's going to take a minute or two. It's going to do its thing. It's going to unwarp the VR video for us. So this process is all dependent on the size of your video footage. If you have a longer video, then of course it's going to take longer to de-warp it all. Uh, but I have a really short clip, so this isn't going to take long at all. So we'll come back once this is finished, and I'll show you the finished product. All right, so we're all done here. And as you can see in our Unwarp folder, we now have a file called Out. And if we open up the Output folder, you can see the same video clip I showed you earlier, and it is now de-warped. How easy was that? Alright guys, well I hope this video tutorial was helpful. If so, please leave a comment and a like and subscribe to the channel. Guys, have a good one and we'll see you in the next video.